nearly half of Benin's population lives on less than a dollar a day. A recent United Nations study shows that over 40% of children ages 5 to 14 are working and not going to school. For Mama Tuni Wagusuru and her husband, yes, going to school was never an option. I've never set foot in school. My parents were farmers and I am a farmer. The Oruz see an opportunity for their children. UNICEF and the government of Benin have created community kindergartens in remote areas such as Sinendi, so that children such as four-year-old Waihiru have a strong foundation going into primary school. Uh, With the commencement of this UNICEF-supported program, the education system in Benin was in a poor state. In addition to low access of schooling for children, three other issues affected the state of Benin's educational system. First, the enrollment of children in two schools was very low. Second, the rate of school children completing primary school was low. Children in the kindergarten program sing, play and develop their identities in child-friendly spaces. An extension of this initiative empowers mothers such as Mama too with income generating activities such as making she butter and other food items. The kindergarten program is very positive for me. It helped me find a place to keep my children, do my housework, go to the farm, and participate in income-generating activities. More important, it's helping me repair my children for a primary school. Today, there are over 200 community kindergartens in Benin. Sizable results have been achieved, but more work needs to be done to reach out to children, not only to enroll them in school, but to ensure that they stay in school. The education program is indeed a program aimed to achieve educational equality, gender equality in particular, equality to address the Benin's education system, where there was and there still is an important gap between boys and girls and provide them plenty of chances to be able to have access to school. In addition to helping mothers, UNICEF is providing more training for teachers and has already built latrines and supplied equipment furniture and learning tools for the students and teachers. The kindergarten program may help Benin to achieve the United Nations Millennium Development Goal number two, ensuring that all boys and girls complete primary school by 2015. Mama too and Nien see their children's education as a way out of poverty. They are also optimistic that with this kind of education, their child will be the first in their family to graduate from university. Paul Ndiho, VOA News.